Good to see you. Hey guys, thanks for coming over. Uh, just uh, forget what you saw there and let's get on with our two minute tech tip. One thing I get asked a lot is, how do I get digital text from a physical copy? You know what I'm talking about. You've got some book that has a great passage, some article that you've been reading with kids for like a hundred years, some really important directions that you'd like to maybe back up documentation of, or you just have some baller teacher text that you'd like to get a digital copy of. What you want is called OCR, Optical Character Recognition. What OCR software does is it takes a picture of physical text, recognizes the characters, and then recreates it digitally. And you're super lucky. Since you're a G Suite teacher, you have access to OCR software in Google Keep. Today, let's find out how to get that physical text into a digital copy with Google Keep. So, if you want to start scanning image text, you have to use Google Keep. Google Keep is available online at keep.google.com or there's also an app for your phone. Your phone app's going to be a lot more useful for this because with it you'll be able to snap pictures and then immediately grab the text from those. But any pictures that you take with your phone will automatically back up to your Google Keep account online as well. And for that reason we'll start by looking at the online tool. So if you go to googlekeep.com you'll see a notes dashboard like this. Now even if you've never used it before, here is how you do it. Up here at the top, you click the little picture icon where it says take a note, and then you'll just find your picture that you've already saved on your computer. Now I already have some options here, so I'm gonna show you how this works. I'm gonna click on this picture of the FPS EdTech logo, and down here at where there are these three dots, I'm gonna click more, and then I'm gonna click grab image text, and you'll see immediately that, that text popped up right here. So what happened is the screen read these letters and then gave me a copy even in the correct case. This will also work in a book text. So here's just a picture from one of the Harry Potter books. I'm gonna click my three dots and I'm gonna click grab image text. And then if I scroll down, you'll see all of that text right from the book. Pretty awesome, huh? So now let's talk about why you probably are gonna be using this mostly on your phone. So I've pulled up my device over here and I'm gonna show you how this works on your phone. First, you'll wanna download the app. It's available on iOS or Android. Once the app is on your phone, just open it up. Now that we have our app open, we're gonna take a note, but we're going to click the little camera button to take that note down here in the bottom right-hand corner. It's gonna ask us to add an image. We're gonna go ahead and do that, take photo. So now I just gotta find some text that I want a picture of. This is just an article that I found online today from Newzilla. And I'm gonna get that in the frame here, and then I'm gonna click the button to take my photo. I'm gonna click the check mark to say we want that one. And now that opens up in my app, and this is gonna work the same way it does on desktop. I'm gonna click on the picture, and then I'm gonna hit these three dots up here at the top, and I'm gonna click grab image text. And now, as I scroll down through, I have all the text from this page formatted in the same case with punctuation and capitalization, all that kind of good stuff. Hey guys, it really is that easy. Just snap a picture, grab the image text. It'll work on just about any text with clear and consistent formatting. Take a picture of a poster on the wall, take a picture of a page in a book, somebody's presentation slides, whatever. If the format is clear and consistent, it'll work. Hopefully you'll find lots of great uses for this in your classroom. Of course, if you have any questions, let me know. And as always, thank you for watching.